recent cancer research has focused on understanding the mechanisms underlying its formation and progression. Such explorations have opened up one fascinating avenue for developing new treatments for cancer, a receptor protein called Neuropilin-1. In a recent review article published in Chinese Medical Journal, researchers from China have compiled some of the salient work on this compound and its role in cancer. Neuropylins are embedded in the membranes of many cells in the body, including those in the heart, nerves, blood vessels, skin, bone, and immune system. As receptors, neuropylins are part of complex signaling pathways that regulate cellular function in our bodies. Thus, they can assist the development of cancers. In fact, they have been found to be highly expressed in nearly all tumor cells. Neuropylin-1, in particular, is critical for the growth of neurons and vasculature. It also promotes tumor proliferation and metastasis, movement into other parts of the body, by binding to growth factors. Via its role in the formation of new blood vessels, it is further implicated in helping tumors obtain nutrients. It also assists cancer growth indirectly by suppressing the body's anti-tumor immunity. Given these roles of neuropylin-1, some scientists have developed anti-cancer strategies that involve blocking its interactions with other molecules in various ways. In addition, certain cutting-edge technology includes creating mutants of proteins that bind to it to favorably change how it acts, for instance, inhibiting blood vessel formation. Moreover, combinations of several anti-neuropylin-1 strategies or combinations of these strategies with traditional methods such as chemotherapy have been seen to greatly enhance treatment efficacy. Yet much remains to be unraveled in neuropylin-related research. Taking stock of what is known is a key step in opening up new exploration routes and, down the line, finding effective cures.